Greetings one and all, and welcome to the Fellow Braver's Game Showcase Christmas Special of... We'll have to wait till we can get out of this area with the lang choosing our language before we get to the title of the game. We can be Espanol, Italiano, Dutch, Francais, ho -ho, or English. Or English, as it would be in my own accent. So, let's go with English. And this is the showcase of Popeye and the Popeye Rush for Spinach. Let's press start so we can get into the game. Avoid the demo. And let's go check out the options we have. Actually, no. Let's first show you off some of the things. We have a quick rush here, which is basically just a quick race. Adventure mode, which is the mode we're going to be showcasing in this showcase. Challenge mode, which is just basically random versus matches between two characters and one of, well, one of your choosing and the other random. Time rush, basically, you know, what it says on the tin. A team rush, basically, you're in teams of people. And the options. By the way, this game is multiplayer can be played multiplayer as well by a GBA by a GBA link I believe I never owned I well I did own a GBA at one point and this game but I never really owned any of the attachments to be able to play multiplayer but anyway let's go into the options we have sound effects musics and password and records nope there's nothing else there to do now before we start I know this game doesn't have anything crisp, doesn't have any Christmas themes in, but, but, <coughs> but if you, but I have a cunning plan to, to rectify this situation. So, without further ado, let us go into adventure mode. And, we can choose between our lovable Popeye here, our Fan favorite olive oil, mean man Bluto, everyone's favorite punching bag, or we can go with the re real main character of the story of every Popeye cartoon, Wimpy. Let's go with him, shall we? <laughs> and with the story begins, oh Popeye, let's take a walk around town. Sure. It's a real beautiful Christmas day! See what I did there? I've saved the Christmas special! Not so fast, little man. It's me who will be accompanying olive oil on a walk! Dream on, fatso! <laughs> oh no, don't fight each other again! Why not have a race instead? Olive oil, do you realize who you're recommending this to? A race? Sure, you're in for a whipping. First to the docks wins. <laughs> Am I hearing this right? Oh, uh, uh, I don't know what to say to this. But if it's me who wins, you can both go home. Seriously? You're going to tell Popeye to go home? Huh? Where are you running to? Is it meal time already? Wait for me! Oh dear. Actually, no, that's a. Okay, this is it. Isn't this what you imagine Popeye cartoons being like? This is definitely how Popeye cartoons played out. Instead of beating the crud out of each other with, with their crudolas, they've actually started racing each other every episode. And there's a treasure chest up there. But sadly, that's not important in this playthrough. What we're bothered about is getting through. Yeah, by the way, we can use vehicles like uh, like cars and, and pogo sticks. And other surprises that you'll see. Also, this is not the only other surprising... Oh wait, look at this! Wimpy's got skills! He's freestyling it, folks. Also, here's a weird thing we can do, but we 
Oh, but we got to the end already of the first part of the stage. Now this is the weird thing we can do. We basically can do like a Mario Kart-esque like... Like Mario Kart-esque like thing where... A Mario Kart-esque like thing where basically we can just get weaponries. Some of them really weird. And sadly, because I'm so far ahead, we won't be seeing most of them. And here we go. Oh, bugger. Yep, this is the shield. And this thing I have with the chicken. Basically, if I use it, it turns, as you can see, well, it, the icon shows that Blue O has been turned to a chicken. It turns the closest person to a chicken anyway. Okay, we're going to be doing some mad skills with Wimpy here. What, you didn't know Wimpy was a skater on his weekend on weekends? But sadly, sometimes you just wish that you use something else other than the skateboard. And we can use lightning on them too. So it'd be good to use them in a pinch when you're behind or basically when you're uh, r when you're in front and you want to basically keep your dominance in the race and as fast as we and look at that dance folks that is one happy wimpy and there's our password for after we be beat that race this could game could go really fast if you really at this rate Ah, Popeye, who is that old witch? Hey, is that the old hag? <laughs> you think you're smart running like that? You'll be easy meat for my ghosts. And soon they will come and take over the whole town. <laughs> Ghost? Oh, but that's terrible. Yeah, it is terrible. You won't be able to eat the burgers because they'll be going through your mouth. Quick, let's catch her. She has to be stopped. Again, I am not doing Popeye well. Uh, of course, we have to be racing each other in this in this scenario as well. Yeah, you can also pull people back wait if you're close enough to them, which is useful. Oh, mine? No, that my mine won't be useful now like this. Bouncy? Bouncy? Ha! Got him. This is mine. Oh, I saw that treasure chest. Oh, I hit the spikes. Yeah, this is basically... Think of... What the? Think of Mario Kart, but with a side-scrolling platformer. It's... It works, but at the same time it doesn't, and we have to mash the button on this one. And we have to jump out. Oh no, you don't, Popeye. Hey, get back here! God dang it! I will not be made a fool of. We're going to win this race, and we're going to win those burgers! Back here. I don't know if that was any good. If you could please hit Popeye with this with the chicken leg. Yeah, that's right. There's a chicken leg involved with that spell with the chicken with getting the All right. We we had a we had a good run there. Well, a good in ow. Dad Bloody conk that Popeye! I can see why Bluto hates him. Wait, we're in first now. Where did I pass Popeye? What the? Can I? I can't get this. I need to do some research on that, really. But and I really should have jumped off that. But but I had to be an idiot. Let's get those spinaches, folks. 
God dang it! Everyone's in front of in front of me. Let us get ahead. Hopefully, oh no, Popeye got first. Sorry, Wimpy. Yes, we will restart this. We're going to win this race, Wimpy. Yeah, this is what the start of the race usually amounts to. Basically, if you get close enough to them, then you can get yourself... You can pull them right towards you. Get her. Yes, we turn Blue Owen into a chicken. Come on, we can do this. Yes, we got spinach out of this. Dang it. Ha! This race is mine. Get it? Oh no, why did I do that? Dang my thing, my thumbs. Keep away from me. I do not want your whatever you're selling. This is how much a race can change really easily. The thing about this game is it's is that it's not terribly you know difficult but at the same time sometimes but at the same time it can be a bit infuriating when well not infuriating can be a bit annoying if you if you if you don't get right we're getting ahead of ourselves here and just okay so someone decided to hit us here you go and also it helps if you know if you learn about the land beforehand but I didn't do that actually it's been a very long while since I, the last time I played this game was in college during my breaks when I was a uh, yeah, I used to do that a lot. I was basically playing a lot of gaming and g games in college. And we got to the first place. Yes, Wimpy, dance. Dance the dance of life, the Christmas dance. And there's our password. <laughs> you can't take the pace, you miserable snares. You need to do some desert training. Hey presto! Shazam! But where are we? She, uh, she's played us for a dirty uh, she's played a dirty trick on us. We're in the middle of a desert. How we're gonna get back? I don't know, but it better be quick because I'm hungry. Wimpy, please do not eat Popeye and his and the rest of, of the group. Last thing we would want is for a cannibalism joke at this at this point. And I think I just mind Popeye. Well, I thunderstormed someone at least. Oh, I hit the spikes. Oh no you don't. Timber! We're breaking Archeol- I don't think bouncing a cactus is considered a good thing there, Wimpy, but who am I to complain about science and physics? That's it! Spinach our way through this game! You know, I wish. You know what? I kind of wish they did for this game. I wish they made instead of spinach for for wimpy it could have just been like just burgers so you know as a, as his icon instead so what but then again that would have probably been a bit more harder to do for details ha 
couldn't get me because of the fact I had a shield up. I feel proud of myself. And we passed the first stage. Let's keep on going. So like I was saying before, I used to play this game in college when I when during my breaks. And uh you know, I I completed the game quite easily in a fair few sitting a fair few sittings. <laughs> Funny thing about that is that whenever me and my best friend, we were well known in the class for gaming a lot and uh, our tutor at the time basically basically pointed it out by saying that look at those two those two game game a lot and yet what how am I supposed to get through this hey basically as I don't say they basically our tutor basically said something along the lines of uh, Basically, point us out, saying that, saying that we gamed a lot and yet we still got our assignments on, done on time. <laughs> that was quite funny. <laughs> Come on, we got you, Popeye. No. Oh, if only if I knew about the buttons. Well, let's make up for that and do this properly. Oh no you don't. No draggings for for Wimpy. Wimpy is the man. I'm surprised he can fit in that car actually. Hey! How dare you spinach me? the desert. Not so much a desert really, it looks more like a something from a Wild West set. I think this I think the 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 old the the old witch basically got her desert and westerns mixed up. I wish I could have vaulted over that so then I would have had a edge then. Come on, let's get to it. Ah, at least there's no health involved with the... Yes, we are driving a car in the, uh, the ruins. I'm sure that makes sense in the grand scheme of things. Do 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 I have to have a bit extra speed here. Boing! Again, that bouncy cactuses, I don't think that would actually work in reality, but still. There we go. Now we don't have to worry about olive oil. But we still have to worry about Bluto. Okay, this time because... Oh, bugger. Hey! No! Get back here! Oh, you bunch of... Toss boinks. Come on. Ha! No! Come on! I can do this if I don't screw up the uh, jumps, of course. Ah, spikes again. Ah, 
I did worse that time. And Blue had his pants down. I don't know if we're worried about that. Uh, I hope I won't fail again, otherwise I'll have to cut this. Otherwise I have to cut up this episode. Nice guy, eh? By the way, guys, I think we need to check these cars out. They seem a bit uh, old-fashioned, and and I don't think they work. Twenty minutes has passed, but I will not end this episode just yet because it would be a bit because I don't feel right leaving it like this. If I lose again, I will probably will end it, but but as of right now, it's not really something I want to do right now. Let's go supersonic speed, guys! So annoying sometimes when. Oi! Come on, let's get. I'm surprised that. Holy crud, lots of people are firing lightnings at me now! I'm surprised Wimpy can even fit into that car, considering his extra girth. I mean, Blue, oh, it makes sense because he has a, like a, a thin waist, but Wimpy is like really big guy. Ah, if I didn't go really, could have used the. Uh, Okay, we somehow got through that without much troubles. And I, like an idiot, didn't realize that the, uh... Didn't realize I was going to dr drop against... Oh. Double the spinach! Let's get through this! We are going to win this, Wimpy! Let us... Let us go for glory! And victory! For the burgers! Yes! Dance! Dancing! On their... On their pride! Whenever a Wimpy dances, a miracle happens. Let's finish it up by going to the next part of the story. Look over there! Plants! Trees! Grass! Don't tell me they're after the desert! We gotta go through the forest too! Why does that sound kinda wimpy when you set when you write it like that? I've heard tales that a wise old man dwells in this forest. Maybe, oh, maybe he can help us get back home. Uh, let's go. <laughs> and I think we should end this here now. I've, but <clears throat> I think we'll end it here now. Like I said already. So, with that said. What will happen to Popeye, what, to Wimpy and the rest of his crew? Will he be able to get through the forest? And will Wimpy ever get home to his burgers? All this and more, never to be to explained, on this lovely Christmas special, where Christmas is only mentioned once, and... And... Effectively... Uh, where Christmas is only mentioned once. I'm sorry, I just lost my train of thought there because something... Because something... 
because I thought I heard something. Anyway, thank you for watching watching the Spell Brothers Game Showcase of this special episode. And I hope to see you next, and I hope you guys will watch, will continue watching, and, and, uh, and on, on comment, subscribe, all that lovely stuff that I would, you know, uh, it'd be nice to see, and uh, if you could share this with your friends, it'd be lovely too, but, yeah, that's all I have to say right now, I f so I'll see you next time on the next Fellow Brothers Game Showcase of Popeye. R rush for Christmas spinach. See what I did there? Eh? Eh? See you next time. And take care.